what's going on guys it's the end of play and today i'm bringing you another video and uh, this is actually regarding the date that we will see the reveal for the next call of duty which is uh, allegedly called call of duty goats now we have uh, some promotional material again that has been leaked by another retailer this time called uh, gamestop and uh, this is basically when they should display the poster of the next call of duty you can clearly see this is the instructions within the gamestop store that says don't display until the first or the fifth but uh, the actual plan was to reveal the next Call of Duty, whether it be called Call of Duty Ghost or whatever it's going to be called. The actual plan was for the reveal to be on the 30th of April and for pre-orders to start on the 1st of May. So uh, what we actually saw a couple of days ago was Tesco Direct, the UK retailer, and also Target revealing some promotional material. Now the actual plan was for the game to start being teased last wednesday or the wednesday just last in this week and the actual plan was for that to be start getting leaked out information and uh, but apparently that got delayed until the first or the 31st of april slash may and um so that's why apparently tesco and target didn't get the memo and they still revealed their uh, promotional material anyway and that's why we saw the call of duty ghost title uh, the box art title uh, that you can see right here and uh, so that's what was actually revealed if you don't know what I'm talking about you can click my last video to find out about the uh, actual box art or um, apparently what is going to be the box art of the next Call of Duty which is also going to be called Call of Duty Ghosts according to this image and uh, so that's if you don't know what I'm talking about but uh, anyway Call of Duty 10 the next COD is supposed to be revealed and uh, another thing is that if we actually look through the past Call of Duty reveal dates we can see that Modern Warfare 2 was revealed on May the 22nd Modern Warfare 3, May the 23rd, and then Black Ops 1, April the 28th, and Black Ops 2 was May the 1st. Now, we can actually look at the two different companies, Treyarch and Infinity Ward, as two different branches. We shouldn't really compare them to be the same, because clearly they are completely different companies, and uh, they, they want to re reveal their trailers on different days, and uh, so... If, it was a, if this was a Treyarch game, we'd probably expect it to be revealed in a couple of days. But Infinity Ward normally, as you can see, they normally reveal their uh, trailers for the next Call of Duty game very, very late into May. So uh, it's kind of strange that we're seeing it very early. But uh, nevertheless, we will be seeing something that's really, really cool in a couple of days. And uh, so definitely be subscribed to my channel because I'm going to be uploading all sorts of information about it. I'll probably do some kind of analysis. I won't just straight upload the trailer because that's not really learning anything. Uh, I'm sure 7 billion people are all going to upload the trailer. But uh, hopefully I'm going to try and pick out some things that you might have missed. And uh, try and look at some really cool stuff. I'm really excited for this next Call of Duty game. I don't know what it is about Infinity World games. But the trailers are always really, really good. And they make you want to get the game. Uh, we won't be seeing any multiplayer stuff. Obviously we never do. This will only be a single player reveal. But nevertheless, we should be seeing this uh, at April 30th. Unless Infinity Ward decide to change their mind. But I uh, definitely look forward to that. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more uh, kind of breakdowns and analysis of what we will see. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you have. And I will see you guys later. Crazy.